Hello, helping our planet friends. Today we're gonna learn about butterflies. Our focus is gonna be on the monarch butterfly. I love monarch butterflies. Oh, there she goes. Um, we're gonna learn about some of the problems why we're losing our friends, our monarch butterflies, and solutions of how we can bring them back. Bye, Mary. That's Mary the monarch, she's flying away. This pictograph created by the Environmental Defense Fund shows that over 90% of our monarchs have been wiped out over the past 20 years. That means if this represents all of the monarch butterflies that were here 20 years ago, all that remain are the colored ones down below. The main reason why the monarch butterflies are disappearing is because the plant they rely upon is disappearing called milkweed. And the reason why milkweed is disappearing is because uh, people are spraying it on their lawns, gardens, and farms to kill unwanted plants, uh, such as weeds. And without the milkweed, there'll be no butterflies. Quite often you can find uh, milkweed growing along railroad tracks, such as this one here. Why is the milkweed plant so important? The milkweed plant is so important because it is the only plant that the female monarch butterfly will lay her eggs on. The eggs will hatch in about four days after they are laid. Now the young monarch larva, about one centimeter in length, will eat the milkweed's leaf. This is the only plant that the monarch larva will eat. The different stages the larva go through are called instars. Here is the largest stage at about five centimeters in length. Remember, throughout all of its stages, the monarch larva eat only the milkweed plant. Now the larva transforms itself into the pupa, also known as the chrysalis. They will develop inside the chrysalis for about 8 to 12 days. When the butterfly emerges from its chrysalis, it will now feed on nectar from a variety of flowers. However, we must remember that without the milkweed, the monarch cannot continue its life cycle. Where do the monarch butterflies migrate to in the winter time? Here is a map of the United States and the monarch butterflies fall migration patterns or routes. As you can see, there is an enormous migration from the center of the United States to a special place in Mexico. This special place is called El Rosario. It is in the Sierra Madre Mountains of Michoacan, Mexico.